Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to perform the auto rigging in Character Creator 4 for your FBX and OBZ humanoid 3D avatar in just one minute. And after that, you can export the FBX file with the skeletons. If you are a 3D modeler, if you, you want to create the 3D animations or if you are a game developer, all the humanoid 3D models that you created. You must make sure you create a skeleton for your 3D models as well. With 3D models with skeletons, then these 3D models can perform the 3D animations. So start from now, I'm going to show you step by step. All right, this is in Character Creator 4. You can see this is a sample that I already performed the auto rigging. And now it already have the skeletons for, for the fingers, for the whole body. And now I want to reset my character creator for and show you from the beginning. I don't save this project. All right now, the first step what you need is to have an OBJ file or any of the FBX file, which is not yet have any of the skeleton yet. This is an OBJ file. And then open your character creator for the first step, just drag drag and drop your OBJ or FBX file. You can see this is the character creator for you can see the grid, you can see the axis. So if you press Ctrl A, if you press Ctrl A, you can toggle the word axis. If you press Ctrl G, then you can toggle the grid, right? So now, just toggle it to make sure you can see the world axis and also the grid. Next up, back to the file explorer that you can see the OBZ or FBX file, which is not yet have any of the skeletons or rigging yet. Just drag in, drag to the center and release your mouse. And after a while, you can see at the side here, you can see an auto rig button here. Just click on the auto rig. And next, just click create guides. Here, you have to wait for a while while it is, it is creating the guides. And then the next step, you have to make sure you go and just move it properly. Right. Let's say this one should be at, at the elbow here, you double click it, you press Q first and then double click it, move it to the elbow and this dot should be at the wrist here, the arm and then the rest of the guides already correct. So now you can just click Okay, number of fingers is five. Of course, this is a humanoid avatar with five fingers. Next step, just click create, generate the skeleton. Once you generate the skeletons, you also have to wait for a while. Just a few seconds. Now you can see already generated. The last button is buy the skin. Just click buy skin. Now done. Once done already, the accurate, you can just click one more time. And that's all. And then now you can just export the FBX from the character trader for click file, export FBX, the cloth character. And the target tool preset, of course, you can just export for Unreal Engine or Maya as demo. I'm just go going to export as Maya and have a test. The FBX option, I just choose the mesh is enough, then embed the texture, I click export. And as demo, I'm going to export it on my desktop. The file name, I'm going to name this as 
avatar zero ones to FBX. I save it. Now it already exported as FBX file. And next, I just double click this FBX file. It opened by using my Autodesk FBX review. And now I'm, I also want to check it. Just right click and right click and I click the setting to show everything. Now you can see it have the skeleton. This is the bone, the skeleton. And I will try in Autodesk Maya as well. The Maya 2022. This avatar already have, have the skeleton. It already have, have the rigs. Then you can perform any of the 3D, 3D animation or you can drag it into the Unreal Engine 5 as well to make it become a game avatar. So now this is just a testing. I close this, I drag in the FBX file here and I just wait for a while. Next, I just want to try right now this is this is showing in wireframe right let's say I just test it yes everything already successfully rig it. If we rig, that means you already can perform the 3D animations right? like this. Alright, so by using the Character Creator 4, it already have an accurate function. This is the auto rigger that can help you to just create a skeleton for any of the humanoid avatar and export it as FBX file again. You can import any of the FBX or OBJ and rig it just in one minute and export it as FBX for your game developing project or any of your 3D animation project. Alright, that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my video tutorial, if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful to your 3D modeling, 3D animation and game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new video tutorial, you receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy. Happy animation and game developing. See you.